Okay, so we're back again with another episode of how to advertise correctly. Now, basically, uh, some other stuff that I've talked about before was the, there's uh, tons of ways you can advertise. But one of the biggest ways that you can advertise is obviously online. And there's different websites you can use. Well, prior to that, what you could do is clients that you want to come back for like a future reference and then paying again, what would happen is you can have them leave like reviews that are positive and then pass that on to somebody else. So then that way, you know, your account gets passed off and then their reviews get passed off and then they can have other people come and then use their reviews based on speculation. So basically people start with nothing and then it grows up. That's how you usually hear about how corporations started off with nothing before they were bought out by someone else and much bigger and they merged is that, you know, somebody started off an idea years ago and then they just worked their way up and then they became what they were years later because of uh, exponential growth and advertising you know and then of course they got money and power so they can basically flaunt whatever they want to do whether they lose money whether they but you get the idea so anyways if you're looking to advertise the biggest mistake you can make in advertising is not trying at all because if you limit yourself you're only based on what you're putting out there that you're going to get where you're at but if you keep throwing as much out there as you can Every website, every different, even if people like or hate you, I've learned this with certain people. I've always told people, you know, how is it that you can take somebody that people can say they don't like, for example, and they're still popular? Advertise, because people still talk about them. That's what it comes down to in advertising. Hopefully, you know, you'll definitely do something that's worth the time and effort, and then people will know it exists. But if you really want to advertise something, without spending money that's basically you know what you should do is work hard and be dedicated towards what you do be honest with people and give them a very useful cause for what you're trying to represent if you do that then you will succeed at some point and then while you're at it you know sell them a product sell them a skill and have them come back for it again later you know, like, uh, again, you know, like roofing companies or um, maintenance facilities, for example. They'll, they'll throw their name out there. They'll say, this is what we offer. They send one of their technicians out there. And sometimes, you know, it can be difficult or maybe not at all. It really depends on the person and the problem itself. But you get the idea. Service calls are another good example. They send, they send out a crew of people or a certain person to go do a job. They fix it, and then they end up somewhere else. So... But because of technology, they're able to pinpoint what they need and they can use technology to make their job easier so that way they can get the job done and then therefore, you know, make their money. So websites like, like for example, this, this is actually very interesting, um, what we're going to get into. We could make a whole nother video about this too. But if you're like just trying to get into advertising for the sake of advertising, that's the golden rule right there. If you want to, if you want to start a successful business, make a business that surrounds itself through advertising. Cause it, like, I'll give you an example, like Trivago or, um, lending tree when they had, you know, when they played those commercials, they always used to say, when banks compete, you win, because there were always banks that were always competing with each other, and they were fighting each other based on what their, either their financial rates or their, um, what's the other word, uh, APR rates. Uh, basically, you know, you, people were competing for your money, basically. So, and it's no different in this case with like Trivago, you know, Trivago was a website that someone created and they advertised it that they compared like multiple online prices because people like to go to hotels and book, you know, travel. So what better way to do that than to give people a constant idea of like comparing good deals so that way they can be somewhere else. So comparisons in the internet or any kind of uh, online sort of programming has made it significantly easier. And unless somebody can do it better than that, that will always be the best way to advertise if you're putting yourself out there. But even more to the point, again, like I said, if you're advertising, if you're looking to make money, not just to promote in, in a skill or a, or a business, you know, the business could be advertisement itself, you make a business like like what I'm doing now, trying to give people actual realistic advice that can actually help them grow a business. 
the whole I'm trying to think it's just basically a miracle worker that works in in finances um a financial advisor basically something along those lines basically so yeah the internet is without a doubt the best way to advertise now of course you got competition sure but there's always a way around things there's always more than one way to do something and there's always more than one way to reach out to people so that way you can significantly do better than what people have before you had to spend a lot of money to advertise and nowadays you know yeah you can spend money to advertise too but there's if you really know how to play your cards right and you know how to get the right people you'd be very surprised how fast you can grow a business without actually spending a lot of money so hopefully we'll talk about that in a future episode but right now subscribe to this channel if you're not already um, like this if you have any suggestions or questions let me know i'll break it down for you the best i can or have any requests about anything you want me to talk about i can give you advice on that um uh, also i got a paypal account uh down below if anybody wants to donate to that so i can do this full time that would actually be tremendous you'd be helping me out and um you would also be helping me be motivated to make these videos more so hopefully everybody has a great day i'm travis herndon and i hope you enjoyed this